Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I filmed my everyday makeup look. Step by step on how I complete this look. All right, <laughs> let's get started. I am just gonna do all my priming. I'm going to take my Tatcha eye cream. A little bit in that. And then I'm going to just take my moisturizer. I feel like I've been so dry lately. I always usually start with my brows. I like to brush them up first so then I can see where I want to kind of fill them in because I don't do them too harshly. Using this Maybelline New York Brow Drama Pro Palette, I'm pretty sure it's like from 10 years ago. But it's doing the job. So, do that really quick. Okay, my brows are done. Now I go right in with foundation. The foundation I use is the Born This Way Natural Beige. And lately I've been loving using my beauty blender rather than a brush. I don't know why, I've never been that girl. But I've just kind of been loving the way it looks um, after you kind of press it in the skin a little bit. I have a couple brands. I kind of just start on the bottom part of my face, I guess. Um, and I go back in with my forehead when I do a second pump. really work this into my skin. Like even though it's blended already, I just keep going over it. All right, now that we get my face, I go in with a little bit more, not a full pump, but some more. Do a couple dots on my forehead, and then I kind of go over like anywhere I feel like I need a little extra coverage. And it is 2020. I say this every year, but I really want to be more consistent with the channel. I have so many videos I want to do, which, like that I could do like creatively. So I just need to really work on it. I also cut my hair off. That was fun. Okay, next I'm going in with concealer. Um, I'm using the Born This Way concealer as well, and this is in the shade Cold Medium. Oh, my hair. Usually I use um, two different concealers, a little bit of a lighter one and then this one, but I'm all out of that one, so this will just do for now. It's like a nice moisturizing concealer and it's more on the, I would say like medium coverage. Just go under my eyes, sides of my nose, and I'm a chinny chin chin. I'm just gonna go back in with the tip of the beauty blender and blend that out. <laughs> Already, that is all blended out. So now, I'm going to pick up my Kylie Jenner translucent setting powder. This is my favorite translucent powder. Literally just clean this thing and it don't get a black beauty blender. Okay, so I'm taking the tip of the beauty blender, dipping in powder into the skin. I'm not baking, I'm just setting right now. And I'm also going to set my smile lines. So that's the first thing that creases on me. Uh, 
Now I'm picking up my Charlotte Tilbury pressed powder, a powder brush, and look at I kind of just bought this thing like a month ago and it's already hit pan. I'm just dubbing this, pressing all of my foundation in. I'm not swiping it because that's going to move the foundation. Just pressing it. Now that I look like powder all over my face, we're gonna add more powder. Go back in with my Kylie powder now and bake more so under my eyes. And the sides of my nose. Now I'm going in with my Laura Pro palette and we're gonna take a contouring brush and pick up the medium light shade. This palette, I don't know if I've ever used it on camera, like 10,000 years old. It was one of my first Right now, I'm keeping that in one spot, just kind of like lining the natural cheekbone, going in on my forehead. I kind of do a lot on the forehead. I, I don't know. I don't think I have a big forehead, but she's cute or small. All right, we're done with contouring. I'm going to go in with blush now. The blush palette I use is this Morphe 8W, like this. And I'm going to use all three of these colors and just mix them. And then I take a little bit of that to get a stronger color and go right above the contour. All right, my camera wants to die on me all of a sudden, so we gotta bippity boppity boo this. I left over on my blush, and I just put it on my forehead and a little bit on my nose. And then I'm going to wipe off that bake that we did. Since I have so many powders on my face already, I'm gonna spray my face. Um, this is just the Mario Badescu spray. My face is drying. I am going to brush up my brows with some brow gel. This is just Maybelline's Clear Great Lash. Oh, I think this is like your mascara. Whatever. Whatever you got. Let's coat it. And then I take a spoolie and actually kind of like set them how I want them. I'm gonna go back in with that Lorac palette and a little blending brush. We're gonna go in with the light shade and I'm gonna use this as a shadow. So I really focus right here and I like to do it right under my brow and kind of bring it inward to my nose to kind of contour my nose at the same time. And then the leftover, I'll bring into the crease. Same with the other eye. I am going to go in now with my Kylie highlighter in Queen Drip. And I'm just going to put that on my cheek. Sometimes I'll take an eyeliner, sometimes I'll take a shadow. But today we're gonna take a shadow. To pick up any dark brown, this is just the KKW Winnie. We'll define our brush like this, dip it in, and we're gonna give myself a little swing. Just at the end. Just doing it at the ends. Now to go under my eye, taking, you can use the contours that we used, or I'm just here already, so I'm using that light brown, and a little eyeliner brush. And I'm gonna put this under my eye, but just in the middle. So just right here. I'm not gonna bring it all the way to the front of my eye or underneath or to the wing. 
Once I do all of that, I like to go back in one more time with bronzer. So I'm picking up the Marc Jacob Mega Bronze. Big fluffy brush. I'm kind of just bringing this more like messy all over. Okay, my face is done. Lately, my favorite step of my makeup routine has been my lips because I found my favorite lip combo. Sometimes I'll do a gloss. This lip liner is Morphe in the shade Sugar Pie. It's KKW Soulmate Lip Gloss. I'm just gonna... And that's all I do. That is going to bring us to the end of today's video. Every day makeup moment. This is literally what I do every day. So yes, I'm happy to be back making videos. I hold myself accountable to make more. So please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.